Hi everyone. The word of hope that we're looking at for this whole week is grace. We are thinking about the undeserved favour of God, the kindness of God that he's shown to us that we don't deserve. This story in Luke 15 is wonderful. It's known well by many of us and we tend to know it as the story of the prodigal son or the lost son. But I prefer to call this story in Luke 15 the running father because the real hero in this story isn't actually the son but the dad. It's about the father who drops everything and goes running when he sees his son coming home. This is the time of year when many families have sent their young people off to uni or off on gap years. In our culture, leaving home to travel and explore is entirely normal. Many young people have been on the receiving end of their parents forking out their hard-earned cash to enable them to go and see the world or for their education. I remember myself heading off to uni without a moment's thought about my parents left behind. Off I went to broaden my horizons. But in Jesus' culture, this would have been seen as shameful, with the younger son abandoning his responsibilities and obligations to his father and to care for him into his old age. The boy goes off travelling and throws away his dad's hard-earned money on wild and reckless living. And then he comes home and he finds grace. He is offered extravagant grace. There's so much in this story that is wonderful, but the thing that really grabbed me this time was the ring on the son's finger. The father welcomes the son home and he says to the servant, put a ring, put a ring on my son's finger. And this ring would have been the family signet ring and it signified the son's position. It told everybody around about his identity and his authority. To anyone who saw this ring, it said, this boy is the father's son. He's got authority. He's got the right to make decisions and give orders around the estate. We know who that boy is. In God's grace, he puts his ring on our finger when we become part of his family, the family ring that marks us out as his. And what a word of hope that is. In a world that's upside down at the moment with fear and uncertainty, coronavirus leading to job losses and illness and uncertainty, lack of connection with people, isolation, any number of other things. Grace speaks into that, not with a megaphone, but like a quiet whisper. Grace reminds us that we have a ring on our finger. Let's take this word of hope into our day. You are wearing the family ring. You are loved, you belong, you are secure, you are his.